Welcome to the 901. I'm Aaron Wilson. The biggest, but definitely not the best news of the day. John Morant may be missing in action for a few upcoming Grizzlies matchups after he sprained his ankle last night against OKC. Now in this play is where it happened. Morant looking for a rebound rolls his ankle after he and Dort's leg hit against each other. And as you can see, John Morant had to be helped off the court and into the tunnel. Now after the game, it was reported that Brandon Clark mentioned seeing John Morant walking in the locker room. However, even though that was encouraging news, the team did report today that he will be ruled week to week, according to Grizzlies PR. But what is absolutely encouraging is the Tigers on the gridiron. Well, they tied up some loose ends tonight with a big win against UNA. All three phases played well. And after the matchup, multiple players expressed how that win brought some confidence into the locker room after a 59-0 win over the UNA Lions in their last and final regular season home game. Now they turn their focus to SMU in Dallas. And for the ninth consecutive year, the Tigers win over UNA today solidified a bowl game to wrap up the season. Now the Tigers needed to win either this one or the one against SMU. Now the SMU outcome does not matter because they absolutely will be bowling after last year's bowl game was canceled. And the Tigers did it in honorable fashion. Like I said, the final score was 59 to zero. And as you can see right there, Bardo's number was retired today. He still holds the record for tackles for the program and he did wear the number 59. He died in 2021 of COVID. Have a topic, you know where to find me. Until then, that's your 901 in 91.